Hi, I'm Megan. I'm an engineering trainee for Renishaw and on the evenings I also play rugby for Dursley Ladies. My name's Ellie and I'm an electrical engineer and apprentice and in my spare time in the evenings I like to play rugby for Pencode Phoenix. In my GCSEs I did design technology so that kind of gave me the like hands-on skills that I would need for engineering. That's where I kind of got my love for like putting stuff together, taking it apart, seeing if it worked. When I was in school and people say, oh, what do you want to do? I said I'd be an engineer one day. They'd be like, oh, you're going to be dirty all the time. You're going to smell of oil and you're going to be wearing overalls. But I did have that perception, but it wasn't true as such. The reason I really wanted to be an engineer is just because it's so varied. There's so much you can do in the job. Like I could go into design, I could go into manufacturing, I could be a cell leader if I wanted to. You know, the options are open. You're constantly busy, uh, there's loads of different things to be doing, you're constantly learning new things. It's just the career that interests me the most and I don't see why a man should do it over a woman. As long as you know what you're doing, you've got to, you're good at math, science, English, then you can be an engineer, it's just in your head, if you want to do it then go and do it. Uh, I play for Dursley Ladies and I play Flank. I enjoy rugby because it gives me something to focus on and it's something that I enjoy. You make a family that you never thought you'd have, your friends for life. I think teamwork I use the most in engineering as well as rugby just because um, we all have to depend on each other doing their job properly. Definitely communication because you've got to talk to each other about what your problem is or communicate in a game of rugby to get the ball, to pass the ball on, to create a try. Confidence as well, because if you're confident enough to show you're willing to do something, you're going to get further in both your career and something you enjoy as well. So like a flank has their own job, scrum half has their own job, the same way as a mechanical engineer will have their own job compared to like a design engineer. And you have to rely on each person doing their job correctly so that your job will go well. People are surprised and they think it's a bit rough for girls, isn't it? And, but it's not as bad as people think and it's an enjoyable sport. An adrenaline seeker, so I really love the thought of adrenaline when you're tackling and getting tackled. I'd say just try it. Like, you don't know what it's going to be like until you try it. Most people think that, you know, I don't look like I play rugby because I'm so small, but it's not a size thing. You don't have to be massive to play the game. Just give it a go.